It is a hot one in July in Gilbert, Arizona, but today we are looking at two gorgeous homes, Camelot Homes in the Stonecrest neighborhood in Southeast Gilbert. So it's a small, gated, intimate community. There's only 29 lots in the entire neighborhood, actually. You have four floor plans to choose from, and they're all starting a little over $1 million. And the first one we're gonna check out today is plan 6002. So this one is a one-story home. The square footage is about 3,700 square feet. And pending options and upgrades, you can be closer to more of that 4,000 square foot option. Um, so right here, we have this beautiful den with built-in bookshelves, gorgeous molding, and you actually have an option to turn this into a bedroom too, if you would wish. Now, there's wood floors throughout the entire place actually, with the exception of some of the bedrooms, laundry, and then the bathrooms as well. Um, but if you look in the laundry room here, we have these gorgeous ceramic tiles, you have the quartz countertops, and you actually have a double front load washer and dryer. Let's check out the heart of this home, and that is definitely the kitchen and family room. These cabinets are absolutely gorgeous shaker cabinets. You have gorgeous granite slabs, plenty of space to meal prep. You have pull-up seating around the island. And look at this fridge. I love these fridges. It's absolutely huge. Um, you also have wolf appliances and then a gas stovetop as well. The beauty of this home really is in the details. The ceiling, oh my gosh, I just absolutely love these wooden beams and the deck ceilings really is just such a bright airy space and then you have these gorgeous contemporary sliding glass doors that go outside to your beautiful outdoor oasis and then when you go outside you are just greeted with this beautiful pool the pergola has these amazing flower accents the shadows just look absolutely gorgeous on the pool this area has plenty of space there's a barbecue you can eat dinner out here, lounge outside, have company over. You are not going to have a bad time in this backyard. And all 29 lots in this neighborhood are actually on quarter acre plus lots. So plenty of grass space, plenty of space for a pool, whatever you need. So next, we're going to head back inside and go towards the master bedroom. But first, we're going to check out this crazy large pantry. There is so much room for food, snacks, whatever you may need but now we're gonna head to the primary bedroom an awesome part about these homes too is the primary bedroom is actually it's in a split floor plan so it's separate or set aside from the other bedrooms and then off of the bedroom we do have the bathroom here and when you first walk in there is actually a mini fridge you know for all your midnight snacks you may need and then you also do have a closet. It's a pretty decent sized closet, but to be honest, I have seen better, but let's go back into the bathroom. So you have gorgeous quartz countertop sinks, but let's check out the shower. There is actually a full bathtub inside the shower. You guys, I love a good shower. It's one of my favorite things when looking at these homes. I would definitely spend a lot of time in this bathroom, no doubt. So the other closet was very eh, but this closet is fantastic. This is what I'm talking about when I am looking at closets. So now we're gonna head back through the bathroom past the double vanity sinks and we're gonna head to the other side of the home and look at the other bedrooms. So when you first enter this area of the home, there's actually a bonus room separating the two bedrooms. Um, so this home does have four bedrooms, four and a half baths, and the two bedrooms on this side of the house, they each have a bathroom directly off of the bedroom. So they each have their own private entrance directly into the bathroom. Now you do have an option for this house. If, as I mentioned before, you can turn the den into an extra bedroom. But the other thing is too, is you can, and this might be the coolest part of the house, you can actually take one of the bedrooms and it's a casita or turn it into a casita. So it has a separate entrance. There's even a little kitchenette in the casita. And then you even have your own private bedroom and bathroom. So this is a separate entrance, as I mentioned before, but it is in place of one of the bedrooms. 
But let's check out the true star of the show today. This is the second floor plan, plan 6006. Now this floor plan, it is a little bit more expensive. It is starting at $1.5 million, but I am telling you this home, the lighting, the textures, it is absolutely gorgeous. I mean, you have these beautiful deck ceilings. You have the panels on the wall. I mean, the wallpaper in this den, it's hard to tell on camera, but it is so gorgeous. And you also have dual pane, low e-glass windows, which is a big help with energy conservation without minimizing the amount of light that actually comes through the windows into your home. You have built-in bookshelves, the wood, the coloring in this room. I, I'm loving it, guys. <laughs> so this home is a split floor plan as well. It is four bedrooms, four and a half baths. Again, the details in this powder room right here. Um, a, if you can see it on the wall, just the textures are incredible. The faucet is even incredible. So this is one of the first bedrooms. It does have a private bathroom directly off the bedroom. And you'll notice that all of the rooms do have recessed lighting, great closet size. Bathroom is decent as well. And I just love the tile in this shower. Beautiful. But let's head to the main living area. I honestly have no words. The lighting, the colors, everything is just so perfectly curated in this space. I'm telling you guys, if this is my home, I don't think I would ever leave. I mean, just look at this chandelier, look at the ceiling. The beauty is really in the details, the lighting, the countertops, beautiful waterfall countertops, fantastic wolf appliances, huge gas burner stove. This home also has a gorgeous integrated refrigerator. You guys, this space is just glorious. I want to move in today. So now we're going to head over to the primary bedroom. So the primary bedroom is actually directly off the back patio. So it has these beautiful contemporary sliding doors that really makes the outdoors come in. And then you'll see the same thing actually in the bathroom here um, on that back side of the wall. Again, more of these sliding glass doors. And look at this bathtub. That view from the bathtub is fantastic. And then you actually have the shower that has an entry point on either side, which is pretty fantastic. Go through the shower and then here is your closet. And this one, I'm telling you, this one might even be better than the first closet. Tell me what you think, but so much space in store. So similar to the first house, again, we have the that bonus room that separates the two bedrooms. Um, there is a laundry in this area as well. Again, the double stacked washer and dryer. You have the quartz countertops, beautiful cabinets, plenty of storage. And then here we have a bedroom and both of the bedrooms on either side of the bonus room, they each have their own bathroom, very similar to like the first house that we saw. Um, this one, the bathroom is actually separate from the bedroom, but it's right next door. Again, tiles, gorgeous, the details, wallpaper, lighting. You guys just have to see it in person. But let's head outside to our outdoor oasis. There is a large covered patio spot for those sunny hot days when you need to be in the shade, like right now. <laughs> And then you also have a beautiful pool. There is a sunk in area with a fire pit. Great for more of those colder days. But I'm going to tell you guys this, this is the best part of the house right here. So behind this door, we actually have a detached casita with a stacked four car garage for all your toys whatever toys you need. Even here, they have ping pong in this area. They almost created somewhat of what feels like a man cave. And then on the back side, it's actually a bar that has these gorgeous windows looking directly out onto the property and onto the pool. I'm telling you guys, if you live in this home, you better believe all of your friends are coming over to hang out in this space. Now, there are other options for different types of casitas. You can even actually have a six car garage option as well. 
So the focus of Stonecrest really is to be a family oriented community. There are green spaces, there's a park in the very central part between all the houses, and then you're not very far from Gilbert Regional Park and then Seville Country Club. If you are interested in learning more about other communities in Gilbert, Arizona, please check out this video in the corner here. I do touch base on some of my favorite places in Gilbert, Arizona. Thank you so much for your time and have a fantastic day.